Well, hello, nice friends watching the YouTubes. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome. I'm really happy to have you here. I'm Carrie Blaze. This is my jet lagged good time train and it is pulling out of the station. You guys, I've been waking up at dawn on the East Coast for like three weeks and I'm so confused. And um, this is what I had in my house and I wanted to make it. It's Asian themed. I've I made a salad with noodles and this packet that I got in a Japanese noodle box that has um, that like peanut satay sauce and I added sesame oil and soy sauce and all this other goodness. These are fried clam strips that I got at the store and this is my homemade um, dill tartar sauce. Huh. Mm. You know what, it's not bad. They're just the clam strips. They're not like whole belly clams. I should have been eating this shit like two weeks ago, right? <laughs> um, we're going to get into this nice food and uh, I'll tell you a little story time about traveling during the Kung Flu. All is well. I put uh, some of my favorite pictures from my trip behind me and um, I hope everybody's doing awesome. Thanks for joining me on this journey back in LA to deal with business and uh, yeah, let's get into it. Um, nah. I have some little spring rolls, arugula, there's apple, cucumber. Um. I hope you all enjoyed uh, my Higgles uh, little St. Patty's Day song that I posted. Super bummer for him because he had a solo gig in one of the biggest pubs in Los Angeles for St. Patty's Day, but the governor of California um, shut all the bars down. And I don't blame him because St. Patty's Day in Los Angeles especially is like batshit crazy. Mm. It doesn't look like there's much on this salad, but the dressing I made is really good. It's like a peanutty sesame oil. Mm. I'm good. I'm so tired. <laughs> I also want to do a video later. Um, I did manage to get um, a corned beef slab at the store yesterday. Oh my god, you guys. Alright, so let's get into it. I flew back from the East Coast after being there for like three weeks or a couple days ago. And a lot of people were flying. Like, my flight was... It wasn't packed. It wasn't as busy as usual, but it was pretty full. Because people... I think were anticipating that domestic flights were going to start to be canceled. And the staff was awesome. People were chill. You know, some people... You know, the staff wore gloves. Some of the passengers wore gloves and masks. But not... You know, it wasn't crazy. And you could tell they sanitized the cabin. Um, yesterday, Hagels and I went grocery shopping. That which, which shit was fucking like weird and felt like post-apocalyptic. This is weird. Fucking weird, right? Anyway, we got a pretty healthy haul. We're hunkered down. We're doing our thing.
<clears throat> in the meantime, my realtor out here uh, is coming uh, Thursday. I guess that's the day after tomorrow. I don't even know what day it is. <laughs> Tuesday. With her assistant and some people that can do some upgrades to the house and that, you know, if they do that, it'll be taken off the sale. And the listings just keep coming in in Maine and it's really frustrating because I'm not physically there. So I even had a, a FaceTime showing with my realtor in Maine. Um, so I'm trying to, you know, make this happen as quick as possible. Hmm. But it's good to see my Higgles. Again, I hope you all enjoyed his St. Patty's Day song. Um, you know, he wasn't really comfortable with going live. And he wasn't really that hammered. He was just kind of playing it up, I think. He was a little buzzed. <laughs> oh. But yeah, I could see us moving to Maine and him like winning over all the pubs. <laughs> Is that Powerade Zero Sugar Shizel? <gasps> Fran, you come up here. Well, oh my goodness, there she is. With her little shamrock bandana on. Did you have such a good time at your grandparents' house? I don't know if you can have any of that. Maybe an apple. <laughs> is that good? I think she's getting over the jet lag faster than me. Because you slept the whole time. I think somebody said that in the comments. And it's true. Oh, She gets to be a lazy, stinky, crusty old weenie. She did. She had a great time, as you guys could see in the vlogs. And she was happy to see her papa again. And they're napping together most of the time. Are you confused about the time schedule? Me too. Okay, I don't think you can have any more of that. She was very good on the plane. She sleeps most of the time, and when I have to go to the bathroom, they're cool about me just carrying her in there with me. Because if I get up from the chair, she's like, where'd she go? And then she'll start, like, probably walking up and down the aisles. Looking for your mother. Oh, you're so tired. Okay. Maybe we can sign off to the nice people in a few minutes. No, I don't think you can have any more of that. Yes, Fran had a had the fine time. She was spoiled rotten. I really missed her during my road trip, but she's like attached to my mom and my stepdad. I'm gonna try a spoon. Oh, there we go. Hmm. Hmm. Such a random flavor profile, but it's kind of a mishmash of what I was craving. What else can I tell you guys other than I just had one of the most epic trips, well, road trips of my life. And uh, yeah, I'm uh, trying to expedite this process and really get things in motion. Oh. 
Oh, it's all cucumber. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> now that I think about it, I'm like introverty anyway. I don't want to go anywhere in LA if I don't have to. <laughs> you know, so not a big lifestyle change here. And, you know, when you're in rural, like, Northeast territory, it's not much different either. You know, we're already good at, like, socially distancing. <laughs> Excuse me. It's been alright since I got back though. I mean weather wise. It's been raining like 55, 65 degrees ish. I'm down with that. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Really good. Everything's super fresh. This is a total jet lag kind of mishmash meal. Friends, it's so itchy. You feeling okay? It's like she gets back to LA and there's allergies all of a sudden. Those were good. I get those again. All right, last bites, y'all. This pile of goodness. Mm. 
Okay, y'all. Um, I'm going to push through this jet lag by continue to be making and doing. There's corned beef to be cooked and mashed potatoes to be had. And, um, <laughs> yeah. What you say, Fran? Can you thank all the nice peoples for watching? Everybody loves you, Fran. You have no haters. Sweetest tween you've ever seen. She's the sweetest tween you've ever seen. You guys, I'm going to honor my food coma. Thanks so much for joining me today. Thanks for any new subscribers or any new friends. I really appreciate the support. You guys are awesome. Keep snatching up your dreams in 2020. Always remember to be kind. Much love to everyone. And we'll see you on my next video. Mwah.